So you have questions about coronavirus. What exactly is the coronavirus? Coronavirus or COVID-19 is a virus that affects the respiratory system. The respiratory system includes your mouth, nose, lungs, throat, bronchi, and everything that's involved in breathing. Coronavirus is spread from person to person through droplets from sneezes, coughs, runny noses, and saliva. So if someone sneezes into their hand, touches a bathroom door handle, and then someone else touches that same bathroom door handle, the virus can be spread. This is why it's so important to always wash our hands and to try to avoid touching our faces. You might be wondering, but I'm a kid. Doesn't that mean I can't get coronavirus? Well, no. Scientists believe that kids don't get as sick as adults, but kids can still be infected by coronavirus. So why are we staying home from school? Scientists are recommending that we avoid being in places with large crowds, like a classroom full of all of your friends. We're staying home from school to slow the virus from spreading. So what can I do to stay safe? First, you can wash your hands often and before you eat. Wash for at least 20 seconds and make sure you get the space between your fingers and the backs of your hands clean too. Try to avoid touching your nose, mouth, eyes, and pretty much your whole face with unwashed hands. Practice healthy habits. Eat healthy foods, drink lots of water, get some exercise, and get plenty of sleep. If you need to sneeze or cough, use a tissue or the inside of your elbow. Follow directions from the trusted adults in your life. They want to keep you safe and they want to help you. What can I do if I feel worried? First, talk to your trusted adults in your life about your feelings. Ask any questions that you have. Keep in touch with your friends, even if you're not at school. And video chat or call your loved ones who live far away. Try to take slow, deep breaths. Inhale for one, two, three, four, five. Hold for one, two, three, four, and exhale for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Repeat that 10 times. Set small daily goals to keep yourself focused on progress you can make. Set a goal for how much you'll read each day, how many free throws you'll make, how many kind gestures you'll show your family, or something else that's meaningful to you. Look for ways to have fun too. Play a board game with your family, have a dance party, or draw, paint, or write something creative. If you're having trouble letting go of those worries, you can try these strategies. Set a timer for three minutes. Think about your worries all you want during those three minutes, but when the timer goes off, worry time is over. Get up and move to another room and think about something else. Or write your worries on a piece of paper, then tear or wad it up and toss it in the trash. Say goodbye worries. Just remember, it's okay to feel worried. Talk to someone you trust about how you're feeling. And please, wash your hands.